Hi friends. It's been a while since we released the Laravel 10 e-commerce tutorial series. From today, we continue where we left off. So, in this video, we are going to integrate e-commerce front-end template to our project. As you can see, we have default Laravel welcome page as home page of our e-commerce website. So, we are going to change this layout. This is the template we are going to use. Download links are in this video description section. Create front end controller. As you can see, front end controller has been created. Open web.php file. First, import front end controller class on this file. And then, add this view root here. Create this view file. Let's navigate new example front-end root. By trying this URL, we get this error. So, you need to run PHP artisan optimize command in terminal. As you can see, we have this sentence on this page. Next, we need to add these folders to our project. Inside project public folder, Create new folder and rename to front. And then, copy and paste these folders to this front folder. Inside resources views folder, create front folder. Create layout and pages folders inside front folder. In 
Inside Layout folder, Create Pages Layout Blade File. Right click to view page source of this template page. And then, copy whole HTML markup of this page and paste here in pages layout.blade.php file. First, correct each path of CSS and JS on this layout file. After that, it is the time to extend our front end layout on this example blade file. Let's test. Friends, we have now this good front end layout on of our e-commerce project. But we have one issue. We have to display all images properly. Hold Ctrl plus F keys. And then, click on this replace all icon. As you can see, everything displayed properly on this page. Next thing we have to do, is to separate our layout into individual partials. Inside this layout, create ink folder.
Inside this ink folder create header, footer, and mobile menu blade files. As you can see, nothing changed. Everything still displayed properly. Next, make this title dynamic. Next, make this page content dynamic according to the visited page. Just delete these home and product section blocks. Also, delete this quick view modal box. And replace them with this yield directive. As you can see, page content will be appended here. Finally, add live wire styles and stack directives between head tag and before closing body tag. As you can see, live wire included on this layout. Friends, this is how you can integrate front end on Laravel 10 e-commerce project. See you in next video.